What's going on? How are you guys this week? I cannot believe I forgot to mention 4th of July last week because it's this weekend on Sunday. So if you guys do want any meat from Frankie's Free Range Meat, including our 4th of July grilling pack, definitely place an order today as soon as possible and I will get you guys your order before the weekend. I mean, there, there's so many holidays to do, you know, meat for, but 4th of July Memorial Day really seemed like uh, the most important ones. You know, and I was a little disappointed that I couldn't get you guys hot dogs and some like prepared meats, and, and there really isn't anything great on the market, so hopefully in the very near future we can make that ourselves. Uh, but let me show you guys this grilling pack real quick. So this 4th of July grilling package is for this week only, although in the future you will be able to get each of these items individually and you can even do that now so it's going to be two ribeye steaks two new york strip steaks so here's new york strip here's the ribeye we have three pounds of burger patties these are 5.3 ounce burger patties 80 20 fat so you know you got 10 burgers to feed your family we have about three pounds of beef short ribs and here are the two other steaks so this is nice if you want to feed, you know, between five and ten people or, you know, if you just want something for yourself to have over the course of several days on the grill. It's a nice mix of beef. I know some of you guys don't eat pork, so I didn't want to put, you know, the Iberico spare ribs and the St. Louis ribs in there, although those have been very popular with you guys. Uh, so this should be available uh, until Thursday of this week. So let me know how you guys like that. You know, I would have liked to have, you know, hot dogs, sausage. Uh, some marinated stuff, more interesting things, but as I said, hopefully in the near future. Of course, everything 100% grass-fed and grass-finished, which is nice, especially for cuts like short ribs, burgers, and some steaks are very hard to get grass-fed now. Speaking of value-added products, the Jerky Dehydrator did arrive in New York, and I was told by the lovely Chinamen on Alibaba that I have to reach out to my customs agent for import. However, at the time of purchase, they implied they would be handling both the shipping and the customs. So, you know, just importing anything as a business is a nightmare, especially when you're not that large of a business. Hopefully, this gets to my warehouse without me having to spend $1,500, $2,000, which I have in the past. It's just, you know, money on top of money on top of money. I still haven't paid myself anything since I started this business. Uh, it's just, you know, everything always adds up. And I might have to get a bandsaw too because, you know, it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to get these beef marrow bones. And, you know, that's going to be another, you know, four or $5,000 plus install. The nice thing is, you know, when I do get in that slaughterhouse, I would want a second bandsaw uh, to cut ice because, uh, you know, I figured out that the dry ice company used a band so and i was like how, you know how do they you know cut this is it some special machine do they have a, like a laser cutter but there's actually some guy wearing gloves in front of a band saw cutting 50 pound chunks of ice and although you know that, that's not something you want to do it's got to be done unfortunately some of the orders packed today i think we still got about 30 to 40 to go all the dry ice leaking co2 for me to breathe in and let's hop in the freezer and look at some stuff so we got a lot going on this week. The free veal chop promo is still here, so you get two free veal chops with every order. Uh, we have some lamb stew meat available now in one pound packages. Four ounce sirloin steaks are back. So these are nice, affordable, nice portion for kids or if you don't eat that much meat. Almost out of the Wagyu sirloin. Slightly higher marbling on those. Our lamb selection has expanded slightly, but we have a price reduction, which is the main thing on the ground beef as well as some other stuff. So we have the leg steaks, we have loin chops, we have shanks, we have ribs, legs, racks, a lot of stuff for you guys. I bought way too much ground beef, as you guys could see. So if you guys wanna buy some 8515 organic ground beef at a very affordable price, cheaper than regular stuff online. I mentioned to you guys last week, we have the Bacania back in stock. These are the Bacania steaks. This one has a pretty nice fat cap on there. So smaller portion Picanha steaks if you guys would like those. Overall, just too much ground beef. And the main issue is it's kind of packed in these large boxes and I don't have enough crates to store it. You know, running low on a couple things, I'm gonna to try to get some stuff back in stock, but 
you know, with all the bills and the maintenance of the business, it's just, it's just difficult. You know, I'm finally kind of catching up after having to get rid of my business partner a couple months ago. You know, kind of getting the inventory to back where it should be while keeping up on the bills and paying off some previous debts. Uh, so, you know, it kind of sucks, but it's whatever. Uh, the magnesium oil, hopefully the labels come in this week. I have everything ready to make that for you guys, and it will be uh, a product that will be available on organ supplements. Uh, so if you guys didn't see the podcast on magnesium last week, uh, magnesium oil is something recommended for high absorption, and it's nice because you don't have to you know, consume so much of it as we need a lot of magnesium to be healthy. So definitely keep an eye out. I'll probably announce it on my channel. Uh, we do have another product that I will probably be announcing on Wednesday's video, so uh, you can keep an eye out for that as well. And I think I'll try to work on the enzyme supplement either tonight or tomorrow. I won't have an official label for the enzyme supplement, but I should uh, be able to offer some like kind of like samples to you guys uh, on that Wednesday video as well. The post office did show up today, so we got all of the orders out for all of our other businesses. Frankie's Free Range Foods, Frankie's Naturals, Wi-Fi Shielding, Organ Supplements, everything did go out today. So if you guys are still waiting for your order, it should arrive by the middle of the week. It's like two o'clock and I haven't eaten today. I'm actually pretty hungry and I'm exhausted. So we're gonna take a look downstairs. I'll show you guys how much of a mess it is. Welcome to Frankie's Naturals new headquarters. I mean, you know, the volume for this company, I don't, I don't really do that much stuff. You know, although I did have to order some new labels. I got, I got to make some stuff. And I'm a little behind on this, but uh, it's nothing crazy. And, you know, Wi-Fi shielding is, I guess, kind of a mess on its own. It's just, it's tough, you know. Two small businesses can't really buy that much product, keep inventory in stock. It's like the demand for certain things isn't that great. And then, you know, something unusual happens over the course of a month. And I basically sell out of everything. And then I go to the suppliers that I have to get stuff from. Unfortunately, you know, like the fabrics for the... Wi-Fi clothing do come from China. No other country actually makes them. So it's hard, but hopefully, you know, within a month or two, which I've said before, we can have everything back in stock reasonably. I do have to come in early tomorrow or one day this week and try to make some more stuff for organ supplements. I'm a little excited. We got a, a water key for label instead of just selling like blank glass jars. I got a cool little name for my kefir. So, Everything's in stock though, guys. We got the best bars. We have salt. We have uh, the water keeper back, which I did mention in my video on Thursday that was taken down. Uh, so you guys might want to jump on that before I run out of stock very quickly. That's what tends to happen. But I think that's going to be it for today. I'm going to go uh, grab something to eat and I have to uh, make some emails and make sure that I have some more uh, deliveries coming in this week for meat. I uh, need some ribeye, I need some pork belly. I'm gonna try to get my hands on uh, some more hanger steaks and flat iron steaks for you guys. And I have to get even more paperwork together for uh, some investors. So slow and steady, try not to lose my mind. Uh, if you guys can please drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below, subscribe so that YouTube can unsubscribe you next week. And be sure to check that bell icon uh, so they don't notify you of my videos. But I will see you guys for tomorrow.